Hey, what is up, fellow Chris Darnell here, back at again with another review and reaction for you guys. So today we're gonna be doing Lovecraft Country Season 1, Episode 9. Uh, last episode was really, really good. I really enjoyed last episode. Uh, we found out that Tick did go through the portal with Hippolyta, and he went through time, and uh, he came back with a book from George Freeman. So I'm thinking like, okay, maybe Maybe it's another world and George is still alive. No, actually comes to find out it's his son and he wrote a book about what happened through all this craziness. So him and Machos decide to try to cast a spell on him and it looked like it didn't work at first. You see Diane, she had a spell placed on her and she was getting chased by uh, these two creature girls. I don't know what they were, but she was getting chased by them and uh, she finally got caught by them and you see her like just like ripping at her arm so hopefully she survived that and we see lady's house get attacked by the cops and uh you see tick there and he almost got shot but he got saved by one of the monsters so we found out this spell actually did work now he has this monster you know following him and you know under his control almost like a pet like a familiar you know so it's kind of it's really crazy Holy crap. Um, so yeah, I can't wait to see what happens this episode. Guys, if you like this video, make sure you hit that like button. Make sure you subscribe to the channel. Okay, let's go ahead and start this episode up. Way out, I told her to stay inside. Just oh let her go. God. Look at her arm. That's so crazy. We need somebody who knows what the fuck they do. You think that white witch gonna help us? Yes, she will. Because I'm gonna give her time to pages. What? Oh, oh no. Oh no, she already got him. No more magic! That's what the fuck you said, Lenny! You use that shit to save your own ass. She huh? had to protect herself. She... <laughs> she already know. Those pages were the only language we had left. No, they weren't. Christina will help Dee. Christina's my home girl. You know, we're we're kinda we kinda have a thing. Kinda have a relationship going on. <laughs> Do it. On one condition. You come willingly back to Artem the night of the autumnal equinox. Mm. So, ah, say she gonna s sacrifice him. Ah! Yeah. Ah! Ah! He survived? I was perfecting William's metamorphosis spell when the idea just suddenly came to me. That regeneration could be life or... That's what that stone did. Nice. No, come on. You about to get him a swig. <laughs> yeah, that's strong. Look at that moonshine, boy. Tear you up. My blood might not work. Why would you hear Christina? Oh boy. You might be George's son. Oh boy. Oh my god. Me and Mom and George, we, we grew up close together, son. What we went through that night at the massacre. You live through something like that, it makes an unbreakable bond. Hmm. Ah, oh, shit. <laughs> yeah. Damn. George, work on the God wishing he was my father at Nagy. Wow. Talk about emotions, man. Just going through so much this past couple days. Is D sick? Oh, 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 hello. She's back. A shot by her father. She then <laughs> healed you and made you invulnerable. Shit, you need to be getting in this car with me. <laughs> <laughs> oh crap. Time machine? What? It's a multiverse machine. It's a multi You shot it up. Don't you remember that? I'll fix it. Take me three, maybe four hours. It won't matter if you can fix it. We don't have a key anymore. I won't need one. <laughs> Yo, Hippolyta got all the. I could name myself anything. Infinite possibilities. It came with infinite wisdom, and I'm going to use all of it to save my daughter. Now go ahead, Hippolyta. Go ahead, Hippolyta. <laughs> So we're doing this my way. Are you planning on killing Atticus? His blood is a component of my spell to become immortal. 
Oh, well, hey. At least she's being honest. Promise me you won't hurt my sister. Oh, wow. I promise. Wow, she's fine with it. When I used to imagine being white, I always saw myself as a redhead. <laughs> wow. Wow, really? Okay. Damn, Ruby. That's why you can't trust Ruby. I have to say, his parallel universes, it might not be true. And what if it is? Huh? By you handing over those pages, you might have a hand in the death of my son. Oh, no. Oh, crap. Wait, wait, it's working. Yeah, they're about to go back in time. Didn't they burn Mom's house down that first night? Put a whole family inside. But they can't change what happens, though. So I thought you was my father. Fuck that. Damn. When this is done, when D's safe, we're done. Whew. Man. Wrong time for this, man. This is the wrong time for this. Tear behind up. He caught me in a George's prom jacket. All black, all black people know. I mean, go get a switch. They have no idea what's about to happen. To him. Where's Montrose? Oh boy. Where did he go? Shit. Oh my God! You can't mess up the timeline. Oh crap. Is your name George? <laughs> oh no. Catch a nigger by her tail. Oh, Come my here, girl! You ain't gonna shoot her, though. Damn, she hauled ass. Come on, lady. Run! Oh, wait, how'd she get hit? There's a truck of them at the end of the block. There's no time to waste. We need to get the hell out of here. Oh, they can't leave. Yo, this is so Take crazy. our new friend Letitia to the back. Hey, if anybody comes close, you shoot to warn, then you shoot to kill. Yo, this is so intense. Who's that? Name's Thomas. He's about to get shot in the head if I don't save him. Oh, wow. Because yeah, Mr. Freeman's going to find her just like you said, and I'm going to apologize for being such a brat. And everything's going to be okay, right? Damn. Yes. Everything's going to be fine. Damn. I know it's tough. It's so tough to do this and know what's going to happen. Thomas won't mean much. He's just the first in the long list of sacrifices I made to be your father. <laughs> oh, jeez. You were my son. You had me. I did it all and I would do it again because the only thing I ever wanted to be was your father. Damn. It's a good scene. Holy crap. You better be sure of that, bro. Wow, he's gonna let him. And I could get a better shot. No. Oh, crap. He was looking for something. Knew you felt off from the start. Ain't never Tell seen her. shoes like yours. Who are you? You came to the past for the book. We die here, don't we? Yeah. They um. Oh crap. Big a faggot. Oh. 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 Damn. <laughs> Come on, give him the buck. Give him the buck. He saved us all. The last thing he said before he disappeared was, I got gotcha, you, kid. Oh. Oh. No, wait. We must have fucked something up coming through the portal. 
Oh, they did help. Oh, wow. You to me from me That's to her face. from hey, oh. her to him from the son to the father from the brother to the sister from the Oh. Dying. The oh fire my gosh. Not killing the fire blackness. Kill, catch the fire and burn with eyes that see our souls I got you, kid. walking. Yeah, oh, that's so crazy how it works out like that. Hey, hey, young, and she young, gotta sit young, there young and just. Here is my oh hand. my gosh! Catch the fire and live. Yeah, I mean she can't run out. They would see her. Uh, but it sucks. She has to go through all that and just see all that. Uh, she's barely holding on. I can't keep it open. You have to. Let it. Let it back. Oh. No! Oh, that's so sad. Oh my gosh. Yo, that's crazy. Oh my god! Damn, Hippolyta is probably done. Do we get it? Oh my god. Oh my god. Damn, Hippolyta is probably... Yeah, they went through so much. All of them. Emotionally, they gotta be just a wreck. A wreck emotionally. They gone through so much. All three of them. All four of them. Wow, what a good episode. What another jam-packed emotional episode. Wow, really, really good. Uh, I first started with... Uh, you know, Diana, and they gotta figure out what they're gonna do, whatever. You can see her whole right side of her arm is all freaking like dead and like up to the side of her face. And they're like trying to figure out what to do. And then they call Christina to come in, and Christina's like, Hey, we need we need blood, we need blood of the closest relative. And then we get the problems with the whole tick and Montrose. Montrose finally said, Hey, tick, I might not be your father dealing with all of that and how Montrose is affected by that and how Tick is affected by that and then Hippolyta showed up and then uh, it's just it's so much stuff going on then the whole situation with Ruby and Christina and how you know Ruby and you know Letty bumping heads because Ruby's with Christina and uh, comes to find out that Ruby finds out that hey you know Christina is trying to sacrifice Tick to get uh, you know her immortal spell working and she's fine with it as long as she doesn't hurt letty which is crazy uh it's just it's just so much and that was just that first part of the episode then they have to go back in time to get the book of names and they go back to tulsa 1921 right before all that craziness started and how they deal with that and how that uh you know, seeing Macho's, you know, being beat when he was younger, and then the whole part with, um, you know, Macho saving his friend because he got shot in the head, and then we see that this mysterious stranger that helped him out was Tick, and how this already happened. So it's just crazy how time travel works, and uh, so he had to do it because it was already done. You know, you got to keep the timeline going. Oh man, it's it's so crazy. And then with Letty getting the book of names and uh, you know, and she was, I forgot the lady's name, but how the fact that, um, you know, they're the great, great grandmother, you know, and how they had to, she gave her the book, but you know, she wanted to go save her family, but she couldn't cause she was supposed to die there. How Letty sat there and waited for her to die and they held hands while she caught on fire, which is, Oh, so sad. This is a very emotional episode, man. There's a lot of just craziness and very good acting. Like I said, this show is really, really good with the acting. And then they finally get the book. And then, you know, Hippolyta is having trouble holding the portal open. And she's going through so much she can do just to hold that portal open. And they finally get through, but not until Hippolyta was completely drained her hair her hair turned purple. That's how craziness, you know, it was taken for her to hold that damn thing open. And she finally got it. And they're finally it back. And it's just 
they're drained. Holy crap. So much happened in that episode. So much emotion. So good. The show's so good. Like, you know, it's, I think the first couple episodes kind of probably threw people off. The, you know, the back and forth, the just not having a consistent storyline. But now it all came together, you know, with all being together. Now it's like, oh man, this, this is really working really well. So, oh man, I'm so pumped. Yeah, this is such a good show. Guys, let me know what you thought of this show. I really enjoyed that the fact they're going through all this part in time this time period and all the racism and especially that's going what's going around now in this in this world we're in now and what's going on with it so it's good that they're showing this and really in the next you know month or two who knows this could be happening again so we'll have to see it's it's crazy right now so guys let me know what you thought of the episode leave in the comments below thank you for watching guys make sure you hit that like button if you made it this far hit that subscribe button as well Oh, man, that's so good. Guys, I'll catch you on the next video. Peace out.